Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. You're watching Going Going Gone, and we are at Lazy Rock Campground here at Matawa, Ontario, which is close to the Shamwell de Champlain Provincial Park. And welcome to our North Ontario series, and we'll catch you later. So we are on our first um, stop here just by the road. We're actually in Calendar, uh, Ontario. We are on our way to Matawa and the view here has such a beautiful overlook. Um, there's picnic tables here, just a place to stop and enjoy the view. These are the washrooms and showers. Uh, they actually have um, separate stalls for both um, washrooms and showers here at the campground. So these are the showers, they're individual showers. And as you can see, they are very clean and brand spanking new. And they even have a change room area over here. Hey guys, we just jumped off the dock and Christina is pretty much <laughs> floating in space. For the once in a lifetime. <laughs>
Lazy Rock. Is it's a smaller private um, campground, but it has a nice enclosed lake, which is a uh, it's called Taggart Lake. Uh, like what Christina said, it's a small lake. However, uh, it does have a nice beach area. Uh, it starts shallow, then goes deep, like really deep. You can't uh, use your you can't you can't really touch the, the floor. So I suggest you wear life jackets. Got boat rentals, kayak rentals. And we're talking about motorboat, right? Mm -hmm. We're talking about motorboat, uh, like schooner type for fishing. And uh, other than that, uh, for the park itself, I would really say that they do have waterfront sites, as I think Christina mentioned to you. Um, they also have, well, they are building a new, uh, it's like a cabin. Uh, it does not have a washroom based on what we saw. On, uh, it doesn't look like it would have, but the washrooms are very clean. Um, the washrooms are basically individual washrooms. It's not like your typical provincial park where, you know, it's a communal washroom. So you have one shower stall. Uh, per shower area, right? Uh, the washroom is an individual which has a toilet and sink and so forth, right? Uh, and yeah, uh, in terms of the other side, uh, they have uh, in the back side of, or, or should I say in the front of the park, you would have a place which is more wooded for like uh, tent campers. And, uh, but primarily, probably about three-fourths of the park is based for trailer campers or RVers. Um, yeah, uh, other than that, Chris, remember uh, they were talking about uh, how they do the dump station? Mm -hmm. Why don't you talk about that one? Um, so their sites here are water and electric, but their dump station is a full-service dump station. So basically, um, when you're leaving the park, you, you know, just like as a provincial park, you go where the dump station is and uh, one of the staff here um, will be the ones actually pumping out. Um, yeah, basically yeah. it's called the honey wagon. So they'll be the ones to basically uh, clean out your, your black and gray tank if you need to. Um, there is a schedule for it, if I'm not mistaken, uh, it's every other day, I think Monday, Wednesday, and I think Sundays. Um, don't get me wrong, but you can check the website as well. Um, but the nice thing, as Christina said, is you don't have to do the dirty work. So everything is done by them. So it's a full-service campground, in my opinion, which is totally great, right? Um, and, oh, and um, we actually just remembered too. Uh, we are close to a provincial park, which is Samuel, Samuel de Champlain, de Champlain. Yep. Uh, which is probably about 5 to 10 minutes away from here. Mm -hmm. So that's pretty cool and pretty nice. Uh, you can visit that park uh, so that at least you have more things to do within, uh, within this area of uh, Matawa, Ontario. And uh, other than that, I think uh, like for this um, campground, it's meant more for um, like family camping. It's not so much for like um, if you're planning to go as a group, it's more of a campground where I just, you know, relax, take it easy. Um, In other words, no rowdy people. <laughs> they, they want people who would want, uh, their concept is basically just relax, sit back, kick back, right? Yep. Have a swim. Just uh, lazy and on. Just lazy on. Exactly. That's right. Uh, hence the name Lazy Rock. Right? Um, one more thing that we wanted to mention as well is that it is about 40, 45 minutes away from North Bay. So in North Bay, uh, there's a lot of things to do. I'm not really so sure with regards to us being able to go there since uh, we have a pretty, pretty packed schedule. But um, based on what my research, uh, I gathered research, 
that there's a lot of things to do in North Bay. Um, it's a pretty nice place. There is a uh, waterfalls there. If I'm not called, it's like the Duche, uh, Duchesne Waterfalls. And um, yeah, so I hope you check it out. Uh, and uh, yeah, continue to watch the video. So I'm here now at uh, Lazy Rock. And as you can see, it is full service for the dump station. John here is uh, the owner. And uh, how many years have you guys been here, John? Uh, five. This is our fourth season open. Nice, nice. And uh, yeah, um, if you need to have a campground that's full service here in Matawa, this is a perfect place to go. <laughs> 